going on guys welcome back to another video um today i'm going to do a bit of a different video i was going to, i was going to fit some parts that i've got at home we should do the windows up a sec i was going to do a few installs and another how-to video but you might be watching this now and thinking that the name is different um there's a few things i'm going to talk about so a couple of days ago i decided that i was going to change my youtube name um the reason being obviously it was called panther black st which is obviously a reference towards the car i've got it's panther black which is if, if you don't know what that is it's, it's the color for the mark 2 st in black that's what ford call it panther black um obviously it's an st hence the st uh, i was thinking for quite a while it's obviously very very specific and i didn't want other viewers to um, be put off by that i want to be able to bring in more audience that aren't just st specific i've got plans to do videos with like other mates and stuff we've got for example gti's the baths um and other cars too i've got other friends in different towns so i think it'd be cool to you know get more content on my channel of different cars get a bigger fan base of different cars and help myself grow a bit more um so it's now called Auto Bay, as you might have seen. My name's Bailey, hence the Bay, and I wanted to keep some sort of automotive um, reference, so Auto. Um, so yeah, that's the reason I've changed my name. Secondly, I want to say a massive thank you to everyone who watches my videos. I've just hit, well, I hit 400 subscribers a couple of days ago, and honestly, I, I never expected to hit 400. I know it's not a very big number at all, but to think it was, it's probably been about three months now since I started the channel, I was up like really early in the morning because of the crappy sleeping pattern during lockdown when I wasn't working. One day at like 3 a.m. I decided to post a video of my car and it's 24 seconds long, crap video. And to think now it's on 16,000 views for whatever reason, it's mental. So that kind of gave me the motivation and the push to carry on making videos for this channel. So once again, go back to the name. I wanted to pick a name that's quite catchy, something more personal to me and wouldn't leave future viewers wondering why I've got a name called Panther Black ST if I don't have the ST in the future. Um, I'm not selling the car anytime soon, but I'm not saying I'm going to keep it forever, so the ST part of the name had to go for me. But once again, guys, thank you very, very much for 400 subscribers. I'm honestly very, very grateful for it. Um, so road to 500 now, which will be a good number to hit, halfway to 1,000. But um, when it comes to YouTube, I've got some plans. Like I said, I want to do some collaborations with my mates, get some other cars on the platform. Um, obviously, carry on modding the ST. Uh, I've got intention to save for a daily now. I want to get myself a daily di uh, diesel, so a bit more economic. I live, I work very close to um, where I live, so it's not too bad, but it'd be quite nice to put as few miles on this as possible, keep it nice for weekends, and just keep it for YouTube, really. It'd be well cool if like any of you could put anything in the comments on the, any, any suggestions at all, something that you would like to see on the channel, something that you want to see, um, whether that's certain parts you want me to fit, obviously within budget I suppose, I don't want to spend in thousands and thousands of pounds, but things that you want to see fit, if I can show you how to do it, or videos of me driving and talking to you now, giving you updates on certain things, things you want to know, what are my plans, blah blah blah. But I, I just think it would be a nice change for you to give me some ideas, see what you guys actually want to see. Um, my videos are doing pretty well, to be honest. Like I said, I've only been doing this, it's coming up to three months now. I think it might be three months this Sunday, so this will come out on the Sunday. But to think that I've gained 410 or whatever it is subscribers in three months to me is mental. I never thought I'd grow this fast. So there's no point now trying to back off from it. I might as well push myself more and more and see how far I can go with it. So like in terms of mods that I've got at home, or parts I should say, not mods. Um, something I ordered weeks ago, about five weeks ago, was the AirTech uh, crossover pipe. Obviously I've done the turbo to crossover pipe if you've not seen that. And um, yes, yeah, so I've got that to fit, which I'm excited to fit, make the engine bay look much, much nicer. I didn't realize the diameter of it is huge. I thought for some reason the OEM crossover pipe is gonna be the same size in diameter at each side as the aftermarket ones, but it's not. So I'm guessing we might get some more noise, but again, in that video, I'll do a comparison video. Um, any performance difference? I doubt there will be. Uh, what else have I got? I bought a uh, big shout out to Lordy ST for giving me the info on this. Um, I bought myself a really nice digital boost gauge in PSI. Obviously the ST comes standard with an analog bar gauge, but since this has got a stage one tune now and again, depending on what gear I'm in, like uh, third, fourth, fifth, and sixth, it'll boost up to 1.2 bar. Um, so it'd be nice to see exactly uh, what it's boosting to in PSI. Um, 
So that'll be a bit of a tricky, fiddly thing to fit. Um, so it'll be a nice install to do. Uh, I've got some easier things to fit, like, well, I've got fog lights to fit that cost me six quid um, to replace the horrible yellow ones that I've got. And some other things I want to buy, just some things, so some new ideas. So feel free, guys, leave in the comments what of those you'd like to see first, what you want to see from me, and I'll be happy to post them. solution blah 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 so I'm making these videos to almost help my previous self when I was looking for help and the easiest solutions to do things so that's the reason I make the videos um, to help people um, fit things to their car the easiest way make it as easy as possible and as easy as possible to understand so guys, I think that's kind of everything I wanted to talk about in this video. Um, just give you a bit of an update on what I'm doing, why I changed the name, thanks for the subscribers, and just all that kind of stuff really. A little short video for this week. Um, so let me know Let me know what you want uh, to see fitted for next week. I'll give you a list of things that I've got at home ready to go. So let me know what you want to see. Um, I hope you did enjoy the video. Please give it a like if you did. Um, make sure to subscribe if you want to see my journey through YouTube, but hopefully my future videos and previous videos can help you out. So. Have a good weekend, guys. I'll see you next week. Peace.